out here this morning with uh, Brian Cregan, and uh, we're talking about the most important club in the bag, the driver. How important is it to get off the tee? Absolutely, yeah. And uh, one of the main things uh, that contributes to hitting the ball both straight and far uh, is centeredness of contact. So that's what we're going to talk about today. Uh, I've got this can of Dr. Scholl's uh, foot spray powder. And it seems like a strange training aid, but you may have seen uh, myself or the rest of the staff using this during our lessons. Uh, basically, we spray the face. And this is going to give us feedback on where we're hitting the ball uh, and where, where we're making contact. So just spray this down. I'm going to hit a couple shots and see where I'm hitting it on the club face. So believe so, it or not, where you hit it on the face will affect how the ball curves and flies. Right. So it's really important that every golfer has an understanding of their tendencies and where they might be hitting on the face because it could be affecting your ability to not only hit it long, but also just to hit the fairway. Let's yeah. take a look at that one. That one was pretty centered uh, and flew pretty straight overall. Uh, but if you happen to hit it way off the toe or the heel or high or low on the face, that's going to create uh, some differing effects. You're going to transfer less energy to the ball. It's not going to go as far first and foremost. And then it may actually curve based on where you're hitting it on the face. Uh, so if you hit it way on the toe, it might tend to start right and hook. If you hit it on the heel, it's going to start to uh, start left and, and fade. If you hit it really low on the face, which I see often in my lessons, ball tends to launch low and spin a lot. It's a huge distance loss uh, hitting it too low on the club face. So obviously the intention for your longest straightest drive would be to hit it dead center on the club. But there are also times where you might just want to hit a fairway, right, Brian? Sure. So I know sometimes I'm just looking to hit one straight and get a ball in play. I will tee it low to deliberately hit it on the bottom of the face because I find that it doesn't go as far, but it goes very straight. Absolutely, yeah. Uh, induce a little bit more spin maybe. Um, you know, I don't re necessarily recommend that at slower swing speeds um, just because distance is so important. But for higher speed players, I uh, definitely uh, have observed that players actually intentionally hitting it on different parts of the face to create uh, the desired effect. 